Okay, so now we are going to learn how to find the value of each power. So you're going to be given several examples. The first is going to be read 7 to the second power, or you can read it 7 squared. You can read it either way. We're going to go with 7 squared, and 7 squared means 7 times 7. Well, what is the value of 7 times 7? That is 49. So there's your first example. On to the second example, we're going to go with 5 to the third power, otherwise known as 5 cubed. Well, 5 cubed means 5 times 5 times 5. Well, what's the value of 5 times 5 times 5? Well, 5 times 5 is 25. And then we still have a times 5 to bring down. So 25 times 5, 125. And then on the last example, something a little bit more challenging is going to be 6 to the 4th power. Well, what does 6 to the 4th power mean? Let's actually start by telling you what it does not mean. It does not mean 6 times 4. If you think that 6 to the power of 4 or 6 to the 4th power equals 24, you are sadly mistaken. That will be counted incorrect all the time. So don't just do the base which again the yellow there is the base and the purple is the exponent you don't just multiply those two six to the fourth power means six times six times six times six so when it says find the value we just do the math six times six i know is 36 but i also know six times six is 36 and then all that's left is 36 times 36 which i'm using the calculator nothing wrong with that and that gives me 1296 that is the value of powers